Hey everyone, Shabby Game here, and we are back with another 50 Witchwood packs. Let's get straight into it. If you've not seen yesterday's episode, go back and check it out. We got so many legend. Oh my god, got another legendary straight away. Oh my god, this is incredible. We got six legendaries in the last episode. And we start this episode. We've got Woodcut of Axe, that's a new one. <coughs> now I'm not gonna go through these cards much if we haven't if we got them last episode, so. Woodcut as Atch is a death rat. I'll give him 2 1 to a random rush minion, which could be useful. Legendary. Come on, Lord, I want Lord Godfrey as well. Darius Crowley. That's a really good card, actually. It's really useful in the Warrior decks. Nice. Could not believe the legendaries are getting. Are they upped it? It's almost like they've upped the drop rate on legendaries all of a sudden. Right. So those are all ones we had before. A couple of rares as well. Ooh. We've already got that one, but a golden bonfire elemental looks pretty awesome, doesn't it? I like that. So we're really just basically going on a hunt for more legendaries, really, aren't we? That's the uh, that's the key to this. Get as many legendaries as we can. Forest guide at the end of your turn. Both trayers, trayers? both players draw a card. Um, okay, we've got an epic. Anything new there? No, oh, which would imp? Stealth, death rat will give a random enemy minion plus two health. That's pretty useful, actually. Um, yes. Can keep some really horrible, sticky stuff on the board. And a witch's cauldron. After a friendly minion dies, add a random shaman spell to your hand. Is that useful for for hag of a shaman? I want a hag of a. That's what I want. So I, the, the two legendaries, I, oh, the three legendaries I still want in this final hundred packs is Hagatha, uh, Lord Godfrey. And uh, the White Lady. Those are the three that I really want to get. All these are duplicates. Oh, Paragon of Light is a new one. While this minion has three or more attack, it has Taunt and Lifesteal. So basically you've got to buff this. Uh, which we, If we buff it, give it a Taunt and Lifesteal, that's going to be a really useful card. Actually. There's a lot of ways of buffing cards. Yeah, last episode as well, we had two packs with two legendaries in the pack. That was incredible. Right, all of these are duplicates, Witching Arrow, random uh, friendly beast died this game. So Druid have basically got a... Druid have got a... Um, a resurrection style card. I don't know how useful it's going to be because it only works on beasts. Um, so maybe if you have like one really strong beast in your deck and that's it, then you know that you can use that to bring it back over and over again. It's useful. Deadly Arsenal. Reveal a weapon from your deck. Deal its attack to all minions. That's useful actually. I like that. So if you play with just a Gore Howl in your deck, then you'll de deal 7 damage to all minions. Which is pretty good, actually. Think about it. Right. Anything in this one? We've got one rare. Okay. Yeah. Well, two rares, actually. Um, these are all duplicates. Gilnean Royal Guard. Divine Shield Rush. Each time it's in your hands, switch its attack and health. 8-3 or 3-8. Pretty useful, actually. Both ways, yeah. right? And Dark Possession, we've had a few of those already. We are really milking in the dust, aren't we? So that we're going to do, we're going to down to um, 60 packs, then we'll do the final 60 packs tomorrow. And then hopefully by then we will at least have some gameplay of me trying out some decks. I think instead of me just playing random episodes, I'm going to just try different decks every episode, I think is a good way of doing it. And then just sort of test them out, seeing how I get on, um, see what I think of them. I'll say I'm not a great Hearthstone player, as if you've watched a lot of my videos, you will know that I'm actually pretty awful at the game. So, um, yeah, I wouldn't pay too much attention to what I say. But still, we're going to have some fun along the way. That's, that's the main thing. Chief Inspector, destroy all secrets. Love it. Absolutely love it. I hate, hate, hate playing against Mage with secrets. So that card can really be great. Be even better if it gave you plus one, one for each secret it destroyed. That'd be nice. Right, so all of those are duplicates. And the rare is also a duplicate. Witching Hour. We've got one legendary so far in this episode, six in the previous episode. So we're up to seven legendaries in the first 55 packs, which is absolutely Man. stupid. And I got the legendary when I first started the game up as well. I got the mage one. Uh, all of those are duplicates. I got the mage one where you get an extra copy of each card when you draw it. So it's uh, it could be useful. We don't honestly know at this point in time. Until we sort of get some of these decks into play and test them out, it's difficult to tell. Uh, all duplicates, apart from Woodcutter's Axe, that's our second version of that. Alright. 
that's what we go for now then. We've got a rare, so it's all rare. A couple of slow packs then. Coughing crash, so that's a duplicate. All that pack was duplicates. We are gonna have a bust and a dust, so whatever cards we don't get, we can craft. Which is good. Um there. And then we got Life Drinker as well. Okay, that's the second Life Drinker. Life Drinker works really well in the Shadow Walk deck, so I did three legendaries, I still won. Shadow Walk, Lady in White, and Hagatha. No, four. And Lord Godfrey. So, I've got a lot of the ones I don't really want at this point in time. Um, but they could become useful, right? That's the second Blood Witch. The rest are all duplicates. The rest of them could be... We could actually get all four of them in the next turn. There's the even one as well that I haven't got, which I might end up crafting at some point. But no, my luck. That's the one we'll pull next. The easy one. Oh, a Golden Urban Might. I like that one, actually. Elemental Shaman could be good this time. Got some good elementals for the Shaman this time, right. So we've got a rare, a rare. Two rares. Those are all duplicates, and the rares are both duplicates. Which just means it's just better dust, isn't it, really? One rare. That's a bit of a pack again. And again, all duplicates. Yep, all duplicates. We're getting through this quite. I, yeah, Lord Godfrey, I think, one that's going to be absolutely fantastic. Um, I got the priest one, Comedius, in the last episode. That was pretty good as well. Um, but I think Lord Godfrey with a built in double defile is fantastic. Uh, we've got the odd one, so I think odd warrior is going to be pretty good. Uh, odd um, quest warrior. One of my friends is playing that at the moment. He said it's going absolutely insane for him. Epic! Mossy Horror. Destroy all minions with two or less attack. Very, very good for playing against a aggro style deck. Bring it on the board. You know what that's really good for as well? Spreading Plague. If somebody uses Spreading Plague against you and then you put that down, it destroys all their taunts unless they've uh, Lotus them. Uh, so those are all duplicates. And the rare is a second Merc Spark Eel. So we've got two of those now. So we're filling these decks up nicely. So a rare... You know what, we've got like 10 packs of... Ooh, nice, we've got a, uh, a Golden Vile Brood Skitterer now. We've got like 10 packs now, about a Legendary. I'm getting a bit... I'm getting shakes now. Should be getting Legendaries a lot quicker than this. Well, we should be. I'm, I'm, I'm taking the mickey, honestly. I have so many Legendaries. I cannot believe my luck. So if I was expecting maybe 4 or 5 Legendaries across the whole pack opening, and we've had 7 already, and we've only... We're well, even half through the pack yet. If I can get another 7 in the last chunk of the packs, I will be absolutely ecstatic. Right, so two rares in this pack. All those uh, duplicates and the rares are both duplicates. I'm pretty sure we had this exact same pack not long ago, to be honest. Even in the same uh, the same order, right. Right, so you're nothing. You're nothing. You're nothing, you're nothing. Okay, all of those are duplicates and the rare is... Oh, a new one. Curio Collector. Whenever you draw a card, gain 1-1. One, one. Okay, a lot of people have said this is pretty bad, but I think if you're using the um, the mage weapon, you might be able to really buff this quick. If you put this down after you've already got the mage weapon equipped, you're adding 3-3 free free to it in one turn, and your opponent's got to try and deal with it. You can these big removal cards, or if you can't deal with it, then you're hitting them in the face with 7 damage next turn, aren't you? Right, so these are all duplicates. We did get a golden ferocious howl, though. And Chief Inspector, we've got two of those now. So of course we've got another 23 packs including this one to open. We've only got one legendary so far. We're only guaranteed one really per episode. Um, but I would like more than one. We've got, like I said, we've got six in the last episode, so I'm hoping for more than just one. Uh, those are all duplicates as well. We've got a, we've got a, a duplicate epic there, which is pretty good. Some nice dust from that. Right, so that's a rare... Again, only one rare in this pack. Uh, all duplicates. I think we've probably got all the common cards now, haven't we? And we've probably got all the rares now, thinking about it. We might actually have all the cards in the set. I don't honestly know. We can't be far away. There's 136 cards in the set, so we probably haven't got them all. Uh, these are all duplicates, and that's a duplicate as well. Uh, what have we got? What have we got? What have we got? It's one rare again. Wow. All duplicates, and the rare is Wing Blast. That's the second 
Wind Blast we've got. It could be pretty useful, actually. It could be a useful card. The fact that it can only cost one if one of your minions has died, it's a real cheap way of removing something. Maybe Spell Hunt will be useful with that. Two Apple Bounds. See, Rotten Apple Bounds is actually a really good card, but we've already got like six of them now. And a Red Band Wall, that's a duplicate as well. Come on, give us another Legendary. Give us another pack like the last episode. We had two Legendaries in one pack. That, oh my god, we got one. We've got one, ladies and gentlemen. Right, these are all duplicates. Come on. Lord Godfrey. I think Lord Godfrey is the priority. Or the Jabberwocky, whatever he's called. The Shudderwock. Uh, those are the two that I really want. Or Hagatha. Or White Lady. How Master Shaw. The other minions have Rush. Okay, it's another legendary. It's not the one I wanted, but it's another legendary. So we continue on looking for my legendary. So we've had, this is eight now on the counter. Eight legendaries over the two episodes. And this is a good pack, this one then. So yeah, two commons, yeah. two rares. Oh, Mad Hatter, that's a new one. Randomly toss three hats at other minions and give them plus one, one. So if you've only got stuff on the board and your opponent hasn't, this is a really good buffing tool. Yeah, and the yeah. epic Witch's Cauldron. That's the second Witch's Cauldron now, which I think could come in useful for Shaman. Then again, any class could use it, I suppose. Can you imagine being... Oh, can you imagine using that in a Warlock class and drawing Bloodlust? Can you imagine that? Wow. That'd be pretty crazy, right? All these are duplicates. And the rare is... Okay, that's the second Gilnean Royal Guard now. Divine Shield and Rush and swaps its health and attack each turn. So 15 more packs. Can we steal another Legendary in that? Three Legendaries in 50 packs is still very, very good. Puro Collector's got a second one of these now and everything else is a duplicate. Well, we're halfway through the packs now. And we've opened seven, le uh, eight legendaries now, sorry. Eight legendaries. Six last episode, two this episode. And they're all duplicates. And the rare is another duplicate, a Bewitched Guardian. Right, come on. Give me that orange glow. Give me that orange glow, people. No. Nothing. I asked nicely. Like, oh, no. That's, that's not new. Every now and again, I keep seeing one over and over and over and over again. And every now and again, I'm like, oh, I haven't seen that before. Yes, you have seen it before. You've seen it loads of times before. Right. Epic. Rare. Right. Those three are all duplicates. The rare is also a duplicate. And the epic is a second epic for Warrior, Deadly Arsenal. Could be a very good card, that Deadly Arsenal, actually. Doing all that damage. If you've got, like, a really high damage weapon in your deck. Say, so House probably the best. Seven damage, then. To all it's all minions, though, not all enemy minions. So, do quite a lot of damage to you as well. Then we've got the two rares. Oh, we've got a second golden Carrion Drake. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Nice. I really like the artwork on that card. Got two golden ones, then, now, then. So one rare again. All those are duplicates, Damn. and the rare is a Curse Castaway. Draw combo. That's our second Curse Castaway now, so we've got two of those. So nine packs left in this episode. Can we steal one more legendary? Come on. Come on, Lords of Hearthstone. I beg of you. I Damn. need the assistance of Lord Godfrey. I think with the amount of dust we've got, we should be able to craft. So there's four more legendaries I want. Lord Godfrey, the White Lady, Hagatha, and the Shadow Walk. Or the, 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 the bladder sock. I forgot what it's called now. Um, I want to try and get all four of those. But I should have enough dust to craft at least two, if not three of them, if we don't get them by the end. We should do, in fairness. We should get at least one or two of them. Another good pack, this one, then. Two rares. Uh, both duplicates. And the epic is a second Mossy Horror. Yeah, so this with... If somebody puts down... Um, somebody puts down... Uh, Oh, I forgot what it's called now. Spreading Plague. This is a fantastic return. Really, really good return. Just destroys all of their taunts straight off the bat. It's a really good, really, really good taunt card. Right, so rare. Alright, so we've got all of that. Whack the rare is a bell ring a century. You know what? That's a new card you can look at. Uh, that one has got a battle cry and a death rattle. I'll put a secret from your deck into the into your uh, plate, I think it is. I'm sure we'll get another one at some point. Link Fox, we've had all these a few times now, and the rare is... 
Phantom Militia. Okay, that's a new one. Uh, Echo and Taunt. Really, really good potentially in a warrior um, quest deck, which is what we're going to have a look at with the odd um, legendary. Four more packs. Two legendaries in this pack opening so far. Uh, they, the, the gods have slowed down our, our legendary hunt now, haven't they? Paragon of Light is a second version of that now. It's pretty good. All the rest are all duplicates. Next, then. So we got nothing epic. There's one epic in this deck. Boom, boom, boom. Epic! epic. Toxmonger, nice. Uh, whenever you play a one cost minion, give it poisonous. Oh. That's not bad, actually, is it? That could be really useful, actually, for ball clearance. It really cause a lot of problems with that. Alright, come on. Come on, no, no legendaries yet. Uh, they're all duplicates, of course, and then the rare is another duplicate. And the last pack in this video is going to be... Not special. Well, it's a really bland pack, isn't it? Oh, we've got a, a, a golden cutthroat bucket here. That's pretty nice. And the rare is going to be another Merc Spark Eel. So we got another 50 packs down. We are up to a count of eight legendaries out of... How many, do we have a, how many packs do we have? We had 160, yeah. Eight legendaries and 160 packs. We're averaging one legendary every 20 packs. No, we're not. That's terrible maths. That's really, really terrible maths. Um... We're averaging one legendary sooner than that, like every between 10 and 15 packs. That's pretty insane when you think about it, considering you're only guaranteed one in every 40. That's really, really good. But there you go, guys. That's the end of this video. hope you have enjoyed it. Of course, if you have, please do slap a like and, of course, subscribe if you want to see some more. And we're going to be doing the last 60 packs tomorrow. And hopefully by today, we should be uploading some gameplay for you as well. Me testing out a few decks that I found on the internet and seeing how I get on. Uh, I've been Shabby Gamer. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye. Play my game, the one to do. Play, play.